All right, so we are back to change special edition. Um, this is the updated version, okay? So I didn't have the most up-to-date version last time. Now I do. Also, I'm going back for a couple transformations that some people told me I missed. I missed a couple transformations. So I was told that if I peek through this door a few times, something will happen. So let's see what happens. Poro is Russian. Change my mind. He's not. <laughs> I mean, I don't know where this facility is, but like the only reason why, he, first off, he was speaking Chinese, and that's because the developer is Chinese. Wait. Wait, what's, what's, th what's that? There's like blue goo there. Uh-oh. What's happening? All right, what if I peek one more time? Okay. I'm peeking. Okay, that's not good. Hi. Yeah, Jason Rube looks similar. I know, but what about behind you, dude? <gasps> huh? Run, run. I can't move. Oh, uh, oh no. No, don't approach it. Don't approach it. It's bad. Oh, no. This is very bad, Wigglies. No, 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 no. Stop it. <laughs> he cooled my face. <gasps> Holy crap. Stop smiling. What the heck are you? No! No, don't love it! Unlove it! Hate it! Oh, no. Stop it! Stop it! Smack him! Smack him! Hit him! He's bad! No! What, what am I even doing? Can I, can I control this? No, I can't. What, what? Oh, it's me realizing that... Oh, no. That must be some kind of mind control stuff. No! No! I don't love him! Oh, I see. I was realizing that I was good. I was trying to get it off. And then he, like, did some kind of hand mind control stuff. Oh, no. What are you doing? What are you oh. Okay. What? What? Why? Why? What are you doing? What? What? He fused me into his chest! What the heck was this wavy wave? Oh no! <laughs> I got numbed by some kind of alien goo. What the heck is this? Oh no. I don't approve of this. Well, that happened. Okay, it looks like Draggy with blue and green swallowing all that goo. Oh. Gross. You're just swallowing liquid latex. Does that sound like good yumsy to you? <laughs> okay, there's apparently something else that I missed. That's a cause for alert for a <laughs> Okay, so if I try to go here, like with this three bars or whatever, I was like, human, there's danger in the air behind that secret door. Let's just go straight to the generator room. Then if I try again, yeah, he's like, no. I'm like, okay, well then, but if I walk here, and by the way, you can see this area is different. It's updated now. I have the correct version. That vent over there was um, welded shut at first. Excuse me. But distressed as I was, I kicked that little iron door right away with all my strength. Then I got out. But now, because I used too much strength, the interior of that vent has already completely collapsed. Seems that this way can't be taken again later. Okay, if I go back, now he's not here to stop me from going in. Hang on, though. It's getting hot in here. Let me take off my clothes. Ultimate Goo Beast. What? You say ultimate like it's something cool. Like we're playing Smash Bros. Ultimate. Like, yeah. Yeah, that, that's the ultimate goo. That's like the maximum power. But, like, it's bad. I just swallowed gallons of liquid latex straight from the tap. It's not a shake all. I'm lowering my temperature. I'm hot. Okay, okay, okay. <sighs> Much better. See, it's like when when mama and dad I say, hey, 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 son, don't go that way. Like like Joe, don't go that way. But like, but Ma, I wanna, Dada, I wanna. And then like, but they don't let me, so it's like fine. And then and then the day comes where mama and dada can't be home and I'm home alone. And it's like, oh <laughs> now they can't tell me not to go here. Now I get to go here and, and get, I knew all the cookies were here. Those are some oddly shaped cookies. Hi. What? Hey! Hey, who's there? 
What? Oh no. Let me out. Let me out. Let me out. Let me out. Whoa, 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 whoa. What the heck? It's a boss fight. Ah! What do I do? What do I do? What do I do? Oh, 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 oh. Help! 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 <laughs> I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do. Oh no! You scratched me! Hey! Oh, oh no! <laughs> Help me get cool! No! <laughs> oh no! Snoot became a goo. I don't want to be a goo! Stop petting me! I'm not a good boy! No! Oh no! Also, why is that one on the left shaking its butt? The one on the left is just, just shaking its butt <laughs> next to the camera. We've got a tail shaker, we've got a butt shaker, we've got a paw shaker, and we got an ear shaker. And I'm I'm a ear, paw, and tail shaker all at the same time. But do you notice that out of all the things that could be shaken, the butt is not being shaken because Snoot is not gay. <laughs> I love that little pixel animation of the butt shake though. That looks so silly. <laughs> Kind of adorable. All right, uh, where were we? Uh, so we have to beat a boss. Okay. Um, I didn't really see what I was supposed to do there. Maybe it's just an endurance test. I might just have to survive as long as possible. Yeah, the skunk locked the door behind me. What was up with that? All right. Pro Smash Bros. Echo Fighter's white latex. You can slap the butt after you end the battle. Oh, really? All right, well, let's figure out how to end the battle. Just dodge? Yeah, I guess I'll just dodge. I just kind of ran around. It seemed to work pretty well, so I guess just keep running. <laughs> okay. What's your problem anyway? Like, I just walk in. Why is there a skunk that closes the door behind me? Please. Oh. Ah. Okay, well, I think she always lands where I am, so if I just move every time she lands... Also, I've actually just started by- Oh, dang it! Not again. So much re- Oh, no! I'm a waifu this time! Oh, no! So some of her slashes make me a waifu. The other ones make me not waifu. But either way, I become goo. Oh, no. What's a superhero or, or villain that got transformed through, um, through, like, a cut? That's actually the first time I've seen it through a cut in this game. With, like, the red marks and everything. That's unusual. <laughs> I did not get domed! No! You need trip over some... Oh, okay, okay, okay. Gotcha. Do you have any good videos on how to get Poro's good side to continue on? Yeah, I have a whole playthrough on my, uh, YouTube channel. The streams YouTube channel. Can someone type exclamation mark streams? Okay, all right, that makes sense. I see, I see, I see, okay. Use the vines. Okay. Oh, what was behind her? Dang it! Huh. Maybe, maybe I have to do it from a different angle. Okay, 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 okay. No, no, not this save. We're not even here yet. But that does look interesting. I do look forward to checking that out soon. But yeah, uh, basically you have to say thank you every time to him. And you have to, like, cuddle him and pet him whenever you can. Basically do the nicest things to him that you can. Also, don't play on the easiest difficulty. Or you are guaranteed to die. There we go. There's a save before the boss. Ah, yeah, you're right. We should probably use that. That would save us a little bit of time. Heck, that skunk. I I don't want to talk about that one. I, I, I don't want to talk about that one. That one never happened. No one, no one saw that. That would not the save. Heck. <laughs> We are not talking about that one. That never happened. It's not at all! I didn't derp! Okay, I've been staying up late playing Elden Ring. I have an excuse. Actually, wait, wait. We should, uh, talk to him. Just in case it makes a difference. He might want to... I might have to say thank you or something. 
wait, wait, wait. Okay, that was actually new dialogue. Hang on, what did he say? <laughs> Human, you must pay attention in here. You absolutely must not give in to carefree curiosity. Not always can I help you solve your problems like this. Don't tell me you are hoping to bump into new kinds of latex beasts. No, of course not. Latex beasts are terrible. Why would I hope to bump into them? Please don't go out of your way to look for them anymore. I would never... Human, you're supposed to pay it. Yeah, yeah, it's the same thing. I would never. Why would I ever do that? Are you trying to suggest that I enjoy getting gooed, Poro? That's impossible. No, goo is bad. Don't look into there again. Goo is bad. I would never. <laughs> it's not bump overload. That vent over there was um welded shut at first. Yeah, 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 we read this already. Yes, 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 I get it, 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 I get it. Yes, 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 yes. Oh, wait, this is new. Wait. Heck! I'm accidentally skipping dialogue! Okay, 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 okay. I'm gonna get it right this time. I'm gonna get it right this time. Yeah, yeah, you don't like that. Okay, got it. All right. It's because I was mashing so fast, I, I ended up talking to him again without realizing. Yes, yes, you broke open the vent. You used too much strength. We know this. Yes. Okay, now, new dialogue. Water is the origin of life, and for latex beasts, it's also just as important. Really? I would always collect rainwater myself, but in the case of other latex beasts, they most likely came here just to drink water. Yeah. So the number of latex beasts in here will definitely not be any less than in previous places. And unlike the ventilation ducts, the open environment with water sources here are more suitable for the development and life of these powerful latex beasts. Heard that there are lots of powerful latex beasts here. Hope we won't run into them. Human, you must be super careful here. Okay. Water is the... Wait, that's not what you said last time. Why... Oh, you say something different depending on which direction I'm talking to you from? My body density is a bit greater than that of water. If I sink in the water, um, it's pretty hard to come back up. And as soon as I get into the water, my body will become very heavy. Do you, like, not breathe? I mean, I guess you don't need oxygen. Because, like, I don't know if you've ever been in water, like, if you've gone swimming. But, like, you know, when you've got a full, when you, when you breathe in lots of air, then it's, like, it's easier to float. But if you, like, exhale all your air... Then you can, like, sink more easily. I, I used to mess around in, in the pool and do stuff like that. it just sink to the bottom like a rock. <laughs> and then rise, and then you inhale, and it's much easier to surface. Anyways, it, it's all about, like, lowering... I, I believe that's about the density. The thing in the, now that I think about it, I mean, I, I, I didn't actually really think think about it. Could I really inhale enough... Inhale and exhale enough air to make that considerable of a difference? I guess so. The lungs do expand quite a bit. Anyways, as soon as I get to the water, my body will become very heavy. I, I don't like that feeling. So it's best if I don't rashly go into the water, isn't it? But I will try my best to keep up with you, human. By the way, can latex beasts actually drown? I mean, do you need to breathe? I guess this is the water leak that caused the power outage in the generator room, isn't it? By the way, human, it appears that this place is pretty close to the warehouse you were locked inside at first. Do you still remember the path you walked? First it was to the right, then down, then all the way to the left again. Right now, you're very close to where you started. Ha! Huh. If it were me, I would be pretty annoyed to have walked in such a big circle. Yeah. <laughs> well, gee, thanks for rubbing salt in the wound. But if you hadn't gone in this circle, you wouldn't have met me. So then I really shouldn't have gone in this circle. Thanks for making me even more upset about taking this path. <laughs> so much water collected in here. There was just a little bit of water dripping from the ceiling here before. I never thought that those puddles would eventually grow to become like this. Um, what about the floors below? Would they get flooded? I haven't ever been to the floors below. Also, uh, also uh, this is the generator room, by the way. Hopefully, these generators won't leak electricity into the water. Yeah, I don't want to get zapped. Yeah, 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 we did that. Okay, what if I talk to you from the right? That's the same thing he said. And if I talk from above? Wait, are these... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Is this your goo, by the way? You are, of course, not doing it on purpose, human. Don't worry, I won't mind. I'm already used to it. You are, of course, not doing it on purpose, human. <laughs> Don't worry, I won't mind. I'm already used to it. <laughs> Poor guy. 
<laughs> you you are of course not doing it on purpose. <laughs> All right. Hearing that a vaccine for the rich is being researched in this building. I and other utterly desperate people gathered and besieged this place. At first, I and the majority of the people wanted to negotiate peacefully. We just wanted to live on with our families. But ultimately, a conflict was unavoidable. In the chaos, people became a crowd. Everyone just pulled out weapons and joined the fight. There were shouts coming from everywhere, but soon everyone was defeated. And an out-of-sight third-party force was constantly pulling people into the shadows. A group of noble-looking people yelled, They escaped from the research room. However, they too soon disappeared behind a corner of the corridor. Yikes. I wanted to escape, but I was bitten by something. I fled in panic and slipped into this place. I decided to rest here for a while. The bite wound is not painful at all, but the wound is surprisingly deep. What exactly was it that bit me? 12th of January, I saw some people covered in waxy oil struggling to wander in the halls. They have definitely been hit by some secret weapon in this building, haven't they? The bad news is that I was also hit. My wound began to exude a lot of wax oil. So that's the latex. But I haven't felt any pain. I must seize a chance to leave this building. Even if I'm going to perish, I shall die with my wife and children by my side. I shouldn't have come here. Oh, no. Is he going to goo his family? I write these words with a trembling hand. My wound is fully healed because a wolf's head has grown out of my wound. A wolf's head? Head? Wait, where was he bitten? Like his arm and a head has grown out of that now? It keeps licking me, teasing me with my left hand. It has already taken control of. <gasps> It seemed to want to take over my mind. It's getting harder and harder to stay conscious. Oh, my Lord. Wax oil has already completely covered the lower half and the entire left half of my body. It seems that I am already doomed. I'm going to be part of them. 14th of January. Heart? Oh, no. It's the end. He loves you. No. Is there a difference between you touching poor poor touching you? I don't know. As long as he doesn't gooby. He cannot numb the pauses. He's not floofing anymore, so now, yeah, he's used to it. I guess you're right. Oh, no, what's this? Oh, is that the head? <gasps> that's what, that's the story we read. Oh, no, the, the wax oil it spread. It becomes head. It's licking him, teasing him, and then took control of his hand. <gasps> and then he's a ghoul like him! Well, I don't want that to happen to me, dude. Oh, my gosh. Do not get caught by whatever that is. The general room can ensure that even if unuse, unable to communicate with the outside world, this building can stay self-sufficient for a time. Although I can't even imagine what circumstances would cause the outside world to cut off all the electricity supply to this place. On that note, why would I write and stick such a note to the wall? Who am I explaining this to? <laughs> Let's break that fourth wall, baby. All right. Well, I guess we haven't suffered enough. Time to reattempt this boss.